Because of the importance of air combat, nations have constantly competed to develop technologically superior fighters and to deploy these fighters in greater numbers since the early days of aerial combat. Thus, consumes a substantial proportion of the defense budgets of an armed forces. World War II was a time when tremendous amounts of combat aircraft were produced. But which are the most produced combat aircraft? Today, let's have a look at the most produced combat aircraft in history with our top 10 rundown. At number 10 is the North American Aviation P-51 Mustang. This is a single-seat, long-range and fighter bomber that served in World War II, the Korean War and some other conflicts. The P-51 was mainly used by U.S. Air Force, but it was also used by Allied Air Forces in the North African, Mediterranean, Italian and Pacific theaters. During World War II, Mustang pilots claimed to have destroyed 4,950 enemy aircraft. It was an iconic American fighter of World War II and became a critical weapon in the air for Allies due to its performance and range. The total production of all versions was 15,586. The ninth most produced combat aircraft so far is the Republic P-47 Thunderbolt. This was a World War II fighter aircraft mainly used by the U.S. Air Force. The P-47 also served with other Allied forces, including those of France, the United Kingdom and the Soviet Union. Mexican and Brazilian squadrons fighting alongside the USAF also flew the P-47. This aircraft was effective as a short to medium-range escort fighter in high-altitude air-to-air -air combat and ground attack in both the European and Pacific theaters. Being successful, it was produced to a total of 15,636 units. Up next, at number 8, we have the Yakovlev Yak-9. This was a single-engine, single-seat, multi-purpose fighter aircraft used by the Soviet Union during and after World War II. Yak-9 was one of the most manufactured Soviet fighters during World War II because it was maneuverable at high speeds at low and medium altitudes and easy to handle. It was also available in a variety of variants. The Yak-9 was manufactured from 1942 until 1948 with a total of 16,769 units produced, of which 14,579 were produced just during the war. The Yak-9 was also used by the North Korean Air Force during the Korean War after World War II. Number 7 on the list for the top 10 most produced combat aircraft in history is the Mikoyan Gurevich MiG-15. It is commonly known as the Fago, which is a Soviet jet fighter aircraft designed by Mikoyan Gurevich. The MiG-15 was one of the first successful jet fighters to use swept wings to attain supersonic speeds. With over 13,000 manufactured, the MiG-15 is thought to be one of the most produced jet aircraft. Licensed foreign production may have raised the production total to almost 18,000. The MiG-15 is still used as an advanced trainer by the Korean People's Army Air Force. The sixth most produced combat aircraft so far is the consolidated B-24 Liberator. The B-24 was used extensively in World War II. It served in every branch of the American Armed Forces as well as several Allied forces and navies. It saw use in every theater of operations. The Liberator had a high cruise speed, long range and the ability to carry a heavy bomb load. It is the only heavy bomber to make this list of the top 10 most mass-produced combat aircraft of all time with a total production of 18,188 units. The B-24 wasn't fully retired until 1968 when the last units were retired from the Indian Air Force. Up next at number 5, we have the P-02. This is an all-weather, multi-role Soviet biplane. It proved to be one of the most versatile light combat types to be built in the Soviet Union. As of 1978, it remained in production for a longer period of time than any other Soviet-era aircraft 
and it is one of the most produced aircraft and maybe the most produced biplane in history, with as many as 20,000 to 30,000 PO2s built between 1928 and 1959. Precise figures are hard to obtain since low-rate production by small repair shops and air clubs likely continued until 1959. The fourth most produced fighter plane so far is the FW-190. This was a German single-seat, single-engine fighter aircraft designed in the late 1930s and saw widespread usage during World War II. It formed the backbone of the Luftwaffe's fighter force. The FW-190 was popular among its pilots, and many of the Luftwaffe's most accomplished fighter aces claimed kills while flying it. This aircraft can lift larger loads allowing it to use as a day fighter, fighter bomber, ground attack aircraft and to a lesser degree, night fighter. Being successful, over 20,051 units have been produced so far. Up next at number 3, we have the Supermarine Spitfire. The Supermarine Spitfire is a British single-seat fighter aircraft which served the Royal Air Forces as well as several Allied Air Forces before, during and after World War II. It was also the only British fighter produced continuously throughout the war. The Spitfire, which was well-liked by its pilots, performed a variety of tasks, including interceptor, photo reconnaissance, fighter-bomber and trainer and continued to do so into the 1950s. It is the most produced fighter planes in United Kingdom, with about 20,351 units. Up next at number 2 is the Messerschmitt Bf 109. This was a German fighter aircraft used during World War II that also served as the backbone of the Luftwaffe's fighter force. The BF-109 was designed as an interceptor, but subsequent variants were modified to serve as a bomber escort, fighter bomber, day-night all-weather fighter, ground attack aircraft and reconnaissance aircraft. It was provided to a number of states during World War II and served with a number of countries for many years after the war. With a total of 33,984 airframes produced between 1936 and April 1945, the BF-109 is the second most produced combat aircraft in history. Number one on the list for the top 10 most produced combat aircraft in history is the Ilyushin Il-2. The Ilyushin Il-2 was a ground attack aircraft which was built in large numbers by the Soviet Union during World War II. 36,183 Il-2s were made and when combined with its successor, the Ilyushin Il-10, a total of 42,330 were built, making it the most produced military aircraft design in aviation history as well as one of the most produced manned aircraft. The Il-2 aircraft played a crucial role on the Eastern Front. It proved to be deadly in air-to-ground attack role. So, from the list, we can see that the most mass-produced fighter aircraft ever built were built by the main belligerents during World War II. Anyway, thank you guys for viewing in. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.